welcome back to the International Social Justice Commission YouTube channel. If you're new here, welcome. We are sharing videos about social justice and how the Salvation Army works to fight against social injustices. Today we have with us intern Kelly Mulkies interviewing Priscilla Santos, the Salvation Army's International Modern Slavery and Human Trafficking Response Coordinator, and Malika Ringo, our International Survivor Inclusion and Engagement Specialist. They'll be sharing to us how they got into the work of human trafficking response and what their plans are for this year and in the coming years for the Salvation Army's modern slavery and human trafficking response. To know more about this, keep watching. Hello everyone, thank you so much for meeting me today. Today I am speaking with Priscilla Santos and Malaika Oringo and I'm so honored to be able to talk with you and pick your brains a little bit and learn more about your response within the Salvation Army's work on modern slavery and human trafficking. So today I'm going to ask the both of you first, um, what initially drew you to the work of modern slavery and human trafficking? Yeah, I know for me, I first learned about, you know, modern slavery and human trafficking back when I was in college and my pastor actually uh, spoke about it in one of his sermons. And I just remember right then and there, God speaking to me and saying, this is what I want you to kind of dedicate your life um, to. So it was like one of those very like holy, like God filled moments. And then from there, I ended up pursuing my masters in it and just getting as involved locally as I possibly could. So it's been quite the journey. That's awesome, Malika. Yeah, uh, um, what can I say? I think for me, most of the time I say it's, um, it's more of an inner desire to fight for social justice and you know human trafficking is an injustice. Uh, I believe so much in uh, dignity and uh, value of every human being and um, I think representing uh, those without a voice fulfills me, uh, it feels like it's my calling and uh, consequently as um, like I take a front line in the fight against human trafficking. In another way, I'm also uh, bringing the dignity and the other fights to justice, bringing other causes like gender-based violence and um, all matters that are related to injustices. So it is, it is comes more from feeling that I hate seeing injustices around the world, and human trafficking falls under the injustices. So. Yeah, that's how I came into uh, this uh, field. Mm, that's beautiful, thank you. Um, the next question I'm gonna ask you, Priscilla. So last year's theme was Roots of Freedom and what this meant was that there was an international community we were laying down foundations for this work to grow within the Salvation Army. This year, 2021, our theme is Everyone Everywhere. Can you tell us a little bit more about this theme and what it means to your response work? Yeah, just in the last kind of year and a half, we've just grown so much. We have over a hundred people all around the world dedicated to really responding to modern slavery and human trafficking um, and part of the Salvation Army. And as you mentioned last year, it was really focused on laying down roots, laying down some structure. Um, and then this year, what we want to do is that we want to focus and reflect on how we can truly bring on and be a part everyone everywhere. What does it mean to do this work globally and make sure that everybody's voice, everybody's input and everyone everywhere can participate in the process. That's really good. Thank you so much for just explaining that a bit more. Um, and last question, what are some dreams and visions for the Salvation Army's response to modern slavery and human trafficking that you have in the years to come? Um, the vision I have for Salvation Army is, is big, but at the same time, uh, I think it's achievable. Um, 
my dream is that Salvation Army has an army of survivor leaders kind of working alongside those who are working directly and indirectly with victims and survivors so that the voices the voices of survivors are at the core of every work we do uh, that could be nationally and globally. Thank you so much Malaika and Priscilla for sharing your time with us as well as your dreams, passion and plans for the Salvation Army's modern slavery and human trafficking response. Thank you so much as well to our subscribers for helping us reach 262 subscribers on our channel. Can you help us reach 300? If you haven't subscribed yet, please don't forget to hit subscribe and click the notification bell to stay updated with our upcoming videos and events. You may also follow us on our social media accounts linked in the description box below. See you again soon!